Hi friends, welcome back. Oh, can you guys believe it's already autumn? Well, that means that we're gonna do a couple of fall hauls. So we're gonna start off with the H&M haul. But I'm not keeping everything though, but I'll let you guys know throughout the video what I am keeping. And links to everything will be listed down below, including my sizing information. Okay, so before we get started, be sure to give this a thumbs up. It helps me a lot. And also click on the notification bell if you wanna be notified of my Zara haul try on, which is gonna go up in a couple of days. Okay, so now we're gonna start off with my favorite purchase from the entire haul and needless to say I am keeping this sweatshirt because it has dirty dancing all over it and this is my favorite movie of all times and I'm sure you've seen this in other people's hauls as well because it is that amazing and I'm wearing a medium here and I think I either need to size down to a small or size up to a large it's like in between that awkward sizing and I'm wearing it with a 90s style jeans from Levi's with white shoes Next is this outfit. All right, so first let's start off with this top. I love this t-shirt because it looks very high-end. Um, it has that beautiful corset style that's really in trend right now. So it fits really well around my chest and my shoulders, but it's really baggy here. And I'm pairing this with the baggy mom jeans. I love how thin the material is so that it doesn't add bulk. And the color is more of a faded black. It looks very vintage, which I love. It looks like an 80s pants, so I really love it. And normally, like the fashion rule is if you're wearing baggy pants, you shouldn't be wearing like loose boots because that's gonna make your legs look thick. In this case, you can because this is like the whole 80s style trend. Okay, so I'm gonna try on the patent pants next. It is super high-waisted, and I don't feel like I'm gonna rip it just by putting it on. Uh, this year's version is so much better than last year's. Last year's version was basically like condoms. It was so thin, but this year's version is so much thicker. It's not giving me a camel toe or anything weird. I also got this t-shirt. It's like a boyfriend fit t-shirt. I think this shirt was like 30, $35, which is expensive for H&M, but this is 50% silk and 50% cotton. It is like one of those dressy t-shirts. I mean, I'm definitely keeping this one. And if it goes on sale, I plan to like stock up on it because this is such a flattering fit. It's a boyfriend style, but it's not baggy around the arms. It's kind of like not super tight, but tight enough so that it doesn't make you look really broad. Oh my God. I love everything about this entire outfit. I mean, this is just so me. You guys know how much I love my white shirts, right? So this pants is like super duper high-waisted. My boobs are like right here and the pants ends here, but it's cropped and it's barely covering my boots. So if you're taller than 5'7", um, this might be too short for you unless you like that cropped look. And these pockets are false. The fit is more like a mom's jean fit. It's tapered at the bottom and it has that dressy look that I was looking for. I think a lot of you guys will like this. But next, I bought these two turtlenecks to layer under sweaters, like those itchy sweaters. I love how thin and silky this is. There's no bulk and it's not tied around the neck so it's not gonna drive me crazy. I don't think it's gonna show well in the camera but this is like a, like a yellow brown brown camel no it's more brown super flattering with brown hair and looks great under denim jackets don't shop in the store they never have anything good so go to like the website and pick out stuff from the conscious line they always have the best quality so i love this and i also got it in the black but i'm not going to show you guys in the black one because i have so much to try on next is this camel jacket this coat was so popular last year. So I know this is gonna sell really fast this year as well. I love how cozy this is. And let me tell you guys, this looks so much better in person. Online, it looked really dirty and muddy, but the quality is just so-so. I think last year's version was a little better, but you know, you really can't complain with a $70 jacket. All right, so next are these faux leather pants. I love these as well. This is a problem. Okay, so first of all, these look really luxurious. It doesn't look cheap. And it has these lines in the middle, so it's gonna lengthen your legs. It's cropped, it has no pockets in the back. The color is just beautiful. It's like an orangey brown. Looks so great with a, just a plain white shirt. The sizing is kind of weird for my body type. It's tight around the thighs, but there's a lot of room in the back. So if you guys get your proper size, it might be too tight around the thighs, but fit well around the waist. I would definitely size up. And these are definitely worth the struggle. These are gorgeous. 
How cozy is this sweater? Like it's almost like a faux fur, but I love how slouchy this is. It is boxy without looking boxy. I ordered these because I wanted to show you guys something similar to something I already have that I love. So this is super slimming, first of all, because of the way this is distressed. Uh, it's very similar to my page denim that I showed you guys in my Nordstrom haul. This is the most perfect shade for like the orangey or camel sweaters that you might have. Okay, so this is the other turtleneck I wanted to show you guys, it's not a turtleneck, it's more like a mock neck, which is really great for people with short necks like me. Um, I love how it's so loose and flowy, and I ordered this in two colors because, you know, H&M sells out so fast. It's oversized, but it has a very flattering fit. It goes in at the waist, it goes out the sleeve, but it doesn't look really bulky or heavy. It looks very silky, but definitely size down, you guys. I'm wearing the small here. And I love shirts like this. You can pair this with some like regular jeans to dress up a jean look or just, you know, wear it with some dress pants. I think this is supposed to be like a fitted shirt, but I like to wear shirts like this more oversized. But this is a size eight. I'm normally a size six. This pants is, uh, I don't like it. It's making me look fat, so just FYI. If you're pear shaped, this is not a good pants for us. So just, just don't get this. But on me, I just look, like really wide and this is not at all flattering for my figure so mm -mm, I'm not gonna keep this. I ordered this because I didn't even know that H&M had shaping jeans but basically these are supposed to give you a good stretch while keeping you in. I mean these are super flattering but I don't really see what the big deal is. I don't know why I got a 27. Maybe they recommended that I size down on this and although it fits I don't normally wear pants this tight so maybe they're, because it's shapewear, kind of. I'm gonna try it on with this super cute thermal. It's a ribbed Henley with a couple of buttons in the front, super soft, stretchy. Um, it does, it's tight around the chest and loose around the, the waist, but that's probably just my body type. So this is made out of mainly natural fibers. Amazing, right? H&M is doing natural fibers these days, but I wouldn't consider this like soft as butter. It has a bit of itchiness because it is natural fiber. And because it's natural fiber, it doesn't look cheap at all. It looks really luxurious. Um, I love how slouchy this is, but how cute is this color? Love this cardigan with brown hair. So this is one of the most expensive purchase from this haul, but it is so beautiful. Oh my God. It looks like liquid gold, literally. This is 100% silk. So it's about $100 and it's probably sold out in most sizes, but keep checking. It's definitely worth it. One of my most favorite and most worn silk blouse is this brown silk blouse from Vince. That's like $400. I compared this one with that one and it's identical, literally. So this is the blouse that I wear in my tutorials. This. And this is the H&M version. And look how beautiful this color is, you guys. I almost want to keep this one as well because the color is slightly different. This one has a deeper tone, but just as beautiful. And it's so similar that I feel kind of foolish wanting to keep it. This is a great investment piece. Like, look how cute this is. This is a blazer jacket. So it's like a coat that looks like a blazer. And this is really amazing quality. It's made out of wool, but it's like one of those thick material. It looks luxurious. It does not look cheap. So this is a lightweight cardigan. It's really thin so it's not going to bulk you up. It's not scratchy at all. It's synthetic so it's super soft. I love the color. The color is just beautiful shade of this peachy pink. This cardigan is so pretty and girly. Um, I thought that I would like this one more than the brown one, but I actually like the brown better because the quality is so much better. This one, the quality is just okay. It's the typical H&M quality, but the color is so beautiful, you guys. So this is a simple crop top. It's tasteful. If you wear super high-waisted jeans, it really doesn't show much of anything, but the buttons are sewn shut, which is, for me, amazing since I always have button gaps. You know what I'm saying? So. For me, this is amazing, but the quality is not the best. Well, who cares? It's only like $10, $15. It was really cheap. And this skirt, I'm definitely keeping because it's such a Christmassy holiday type of color. But this, don't miss this. This is amazing deal and it looks beautiful with 
black and we're done you know i always forget to do the outro in the video because by the time i'm done i'm like so exhausted and when i was filming this it took literally hours because it takes a very long time to set up and everything and by the end i look so exhausted and my hair is so flat well anyway thank you guys so much for spending your time with me today be sure to thumbs up follow me on instagram so we can stay in touch okay i love you guys have a beautiful weekend everyone bye